Hey everybody, hope everybody had a great night last night at our flag retirement and awards. Seems Mr. Tony Boney had a great time, was uber excited, and he's looking forward to doing a lot more with our pack. So, hope everybody enjoyed it, hope everybody learned a little something. We'll be doing more of those flag retirements coming up in the near future. I know I, if you've heard, uh, Longwood's actually got a flag retirement collection box going on now. So we'll be probably getting involved with that one as well. We got a couple things coming up in the next couple weeks. Our next couple Monday nights will be a little out of the ordinary. We got a few interesting activities we're looking at doing before we get to our crossover graduation camping event coming up on April 22nd, 3rd and 4th. That's gonna be at the River Forest Campground. That's just outside of the land. So it's a good camping site. Me and Mr. Ed were just up there, scoped it all out. It's a beautiful facility. We've got a huge campsite all open to just us. We'll be the only campers there. It's going to be a lot of fun. So mark your calendars, April 22nd, 3rd, and 4th. There is no cost for the camping. We're going to figure out the food here in a couple weeks and let you guys know about that one. But before we get there, we've got a couple things coming on in Seminole County. First up, we have this weekend, this Saturday, April 2nd, Fort Mellon Park, that is up in Sanford, right on the river. We've got the Seminole County Fishing Derby. So that's going to start at 8.30 in the morning, Fort Mellon Park. You can go on the uh, Central Florida website and register there. I'll have the links on our Facebook page. The following weekend is the Spring of Palooza at Camp Lenoche. This is not a camping event that we're doing as a pack, but you are more than welcome to go to that. You can register again online. I'm not sure what the cost is on that one. That is a Cub Scout event. But on April 9th, that Saturday, PAC event will be meeting at Deleon Springs at the Old Sugar Mill Pancake House, or the Old Spanish Sugar Mill, I think it's called, for our pancake breakfast. If you haven't been there, highly recommend it. Pancakes are absolutely fascinating, taste amazing, you get to cook them yourself, it's a good time for all, and the Springs, absolutely beautiful area. So plan on meeting us there April 9th. We'll probably, I think we're gonna look at being there about eight, 8.30 a.m., plan on getting there early, so we beat the line in. Then, following weekend, April 14th, is the Seminole County Golden Eagle Dinner. If you know of any businesses that would be interested in supporting the BSA in Seminole County, please let me know. We are still looking for a few sponsors for that. We are looking for a new date for our committee slash parent slash leaders meeting, so we can start discussing 2023, if you can imagine that. We gotta start planning some dates. So stay tuned for information on our next leaders meeting. And I really would love to see more people come out and participate in that one. We've got a lot of cool things we're looking at doing. And then, like I said, April 22nd, 3rd and 4th, we'll be at our graduation crossover camping that is at River Forest Group Campsite. That is just in Ocala National Forest on the other side of the land. I'll have the directions and information on that for you. So again, hope everybody had a great time, and we will see everybody Monday. Take care. Oh, and real quick before I go, we are still collecting money for dues. If you haven't, if you still have some outstanding money there, please see Miss Holly or Miss Michelle to get those turned in. And uh, no, we still need to collect for camp cards. So if you have any monies for camp cards, we need to get those collected this week because we have to pay that bill before the week's out. All right. Talk to y'all later. Thanks a lot. Have a great week.